Hi everyone, welcome. My name is Trina and this is TNT. Thank you for joining me today. My readings are timeless, so no matter when you come across this, there should be something in here for you. This is a message for the collective today. It's a shadow reading. So we're going to pull two, two elements of your shadow out and integrate them into your consciousness and that will be helpful for you, hopefully, whoever needs this, this shadow reading. Um, please remember that this is a collective reading, so please take what resonates and leave the rest. Let's get into it. We have Accusing, The Trap, and Revenge. Interesting. Wow. Okay. Accusing the trap and revenge. The trap is predatory behavior, trickery, deception, feeling trapped, oops, being held back, and eyed. Okay. Trap. Interesting. Okay. Why do we have accusing here for the collective? Why do we have accusing here for the collective? We have the high priestess the world and the nine of swords okay so you were so afraid of something happening happening to you that you've gone ahead and manifested something else so you have been accusing someone of something I'd, I'm not it's not clear here in these cards whether they have done this thing you're accusing them of or not because um, it could go either way but you have been accusing somebody of something due to your your anxiety and your fear about a particular thing in your life in yourself within yourself Normally these things are due to an insecurity perhaps or um, something that you're afraid of be, have been happening to you that you're doing it yourself. Okay, why is trap here? Why is the trap here for the collective? Why is the trap here for the collective? Why is the trap here for the collective? We have the six of wands. Two of swords. Yeah. And the alien, which is the fool. So, sorry, the alien is the hermit. Not bad. Um, so we have, yeah, so this is, this is really about, about you, not them. So, Instead of, instead of getting to the real truth of the op situation here, you've just accused somebody of something, or some you've accused people or a person of some of something, and then just retreated back into you know into yourself or into your cave or wherever there, and decided not to do anything about it, nothing else about it. You've just accused somebody, and then withdrawn. Um, yeah, that's really, that's fairly straightforward there. If you haven't done this, maybe this is not your reading. It is a collective reading, so take what resonates. Um, why do we have the revenge here card here for the collective? Why do we have the revenge card here for the collective? Why do we have the revenge card here for the collective? Revenge. Why do we have the revenge card here for the collective? Five of Wands. Conflict. Yeah. Queen of Pentacles and the Three of Wands. Okay. So this this accusing, this is personal. This is deeply personal to you. Um, you did you know you did something wrong here? That's why you've withdrawn. And you know that deep down inside you know that 
that this element of revenge in this situation here is not justified. But you're doing it anyways. Or you've done it anyways. And if you haven't done it yet, maybe you shouldn't. And maybe you should... I feel like... The, I feel like whatever you have accused somebody of, this is not... This is not what they've done. Whatever you have accused somebody of, that's not what they did. Okay, um, what's the advice here for the collective? What do we have for advice for the collective on this situation here? What do we have for advice on this situation? It's a little messy. What do we need to tell the collective about this situation? The Princess of Pentacles. Yeah, and the hanged man. <laughs> this is, um, these two cards together, this is straight up an energy of live and learn. I mean, live and learn, gain a new perspective. It's all the same. Um, it's one and the same. Because it, it this was your mistake here. These three cards first. These, this is your mistake. So you need to realize that You've been wrong here, that you were wrong. And any revenge you did seek out or execute or whatever, or, or going to, that's not justified. That's why you feel trapped in yourself here is because you know you can't elaborate on that. You know you, you're not justified to, to express that anymore. So, I mean, live and learn, I guess. Let's see what the clarifying cards on these two cards are for advice for the collective. What do we have the Princess of Pentacles here for the collective? Prince of Cups. Seven of Swords. And Ten of Pentacles. So this is not really fixable. Here. Um, it looks like you want to correct the problem, but that's not going to happen. There is no correcting a problem like this. And if there is, you shouldn't. Nobody should forgive that. I don't know what kind of circumstances you have here with wanting forgiveness. But, I mean, maybe this, maybe it's a really important relationship to you. I'm not sure. Um, but you don't really deserve it, it looks like. Sorry to say that, but that's, real, that's what the cards are showing me. Okay, why does, why is the hangman here for the collective? Why is the hangman here collect, for the collective? Why is the hangman here for the collective? Justice, yeah. Ace of Swords, the Princess of Wands. Right, so is this really fair of you to ask someone? It does look like it's a special relationship um, if you do have a new perspective on things and you do realize 100% that you wrongfully accused somebody of something and they've had to endure that, consequences of that because of you, um, then I suppose, it, you know, it is justified that you get some forgiveness here with this. Maybe the relationship goes on, maybe it doesn't. Um... Maybe it is a unique relationship. This is really only this is really only fair and justified and just. If you do have 100% new perspective on this situation, because you can't go on thinking these things about other people when they're not true. That's what you've done. It has nothing to do with them. Nothing at all to do with them. Okay, um, 
I feel like we're missing something. I want to get some final advice for the collective here. Just some final advice. I feel like we're missing some information here. What else can we tell the collective about this situation, please? Judgment. Right. Star. The Nine of Wands. And the Five of Swords. Yeah. So, I know that you're struggling in, within yourself with all of the elements I've just talked about here, um, and you're, you're being hard on yourself, which, which you should be, if you ask me. I mean, sorry, but that's my opinion. Not the cards. I, I'm just reading the cards, and what they say is that you should be hard on yourself here. Um, so, with that being said, your perspective is going to change if you're hard on yourself. Don't dwell on it, though. That's not going to do you any good or anyone else in this situation. Don't dwell on it. Just be realistic. Change what you need to change. Judge yourself the way you need to be judged. Do what's fair for everyone involved. So anyway, that is my advice for you, Collective, today. Um, if you like this video, please like, share, subscribe, comment, all of that good stuff. It does help my channel grow. I do appreciate all of your support, and I do hope you have a wonderful day.